Hi guys, welcome to JavaInterviewQuestions.com. This is Sandeep. Yeah, today we'll see one important question: ASCII code and Unicode, and what are the differences? And Java, which uh, Java uses which format? Whether it uses ASCII code or Unicode, and what are the benefits of ASCII code and what are the benefits of the Unicode, etc. First, we'll go through the what is ASCII code. So. Coming to the ASCII code, ASCII code stands for American Standard Code for Information Interchange. ASCII code, ASCII stands for American Standard Code for Information I Interchange. So, what is the purpose of ASCII? So, ASCII code is used to represent alphanumeric characters. It is used to represent numbers, alphabets, uppercase letters, lowercase letters, and spe some special characters, etc. So, to represent character set alphanumerical characters ASCII is used next so how many characters how many bits each character takes in ASCII how many bits each character takes in ASCII so each character in the ASCII is represented by 7 bits so there are total 180 128 characters in ASCII set there are total 128 characters in ASCII set so the problem with the ASCII is it cannot be used to represent all the characters in character set. The problem with the character set is it cannot be used to represent all characters. Example if you take Jain Chinese, Japanese, Thai, Korean etc. They use a different character set. So for those languages ASCII is not supported. So this is one of the major and major problem and major setback for ASCII. It is used to represent only alphanumeric characters mostly in English speaking countries. So it cannot be used for the other languages. So that is the main draw drawback for ASCII. So once again I will be repeating what is ASCII and uh, what is the purpose of ASCII. As I told ASCII stands for American Standard Code for Information Interchange. Use it to represent alphanumeric character and each bit each character in ASCII is represented by 7 bits and there are totally 128 such type of characters in a character set in ASCII and the problem is we cannot be used to represent all characters and next come into the Unicode and Unicode is a character set which is a developed by Unicode consortium and it is used to represent all the languages in the world for example, the drawback of ASCII is it cannot be used to represent all the languages. It is mostly used in Latin speaking countries and English speaking countries. When it comes to Unicode, it is used to represent all languages in the world. As we have seen ASCII, each character is represented by 7 bits and coming to the Unicode, in Unicode it uses 16 bits for each character. And there are totally 65,000 characters that Unicode supports. And Unicode is used to represent all the characters. And this is the main difference between the ASCII and Unicode. And which one is better to use? Yeah, coming to which one is better to use, Unicode is not efficient when compared to ASCII because when compared to ASCII, ASCII uses uh, better uh, and efficient storage and transmission of text. But Unicode is not so efficient when compared to the ASCII while coming to the storage and transmission. So which one Java uses? Either it uses ASCII or Unicode. Java mostly uses ASCII and uses Unicode only for defining the variable names, comments, etc. And by this way it is also supporting the internationalization. So Java mostly uses ASCII only for variable names, comments and wherever we are using strings and th in that place it uses Unicode. Hope you guys understand what is the difference between what is ASCII, what is Unicode and what are the differences between ASCII and Unicode. Hope you guys understand the video. Thanks for watching my video. If you like my videos, don't forget to subscribe to my videos.